like we've done across the entire Muslim world. Just, and, it, and, uh, but, and, and it's amazing for you to say that, well, look at all these Muslims. The minute you give them a little bit of freedom, they go wild and they start being all violent. How can you be a citizen of the United States, the country that has generated more violence and militarism in the world over the last five or six decades, and say, look at those people over there. They are incredibly violent. We play a significant role in what has been happening in the Middle East because we've well, been interfering and dominating that region in order to have access to the I wasn't talking about Israel, violence. So. I was talking about theocracy. That doesn't happen here. No, well, and, okay, that doesn't happen here, but at the same time, Iran isn't invading lots of other countries and occupying them for a decade, nor are fundamentalist Muslim countries the way the United States is. So these things are interlinked because we are continuously interfering in that part of the world. And so to say... It's all our fault. It's not all our fault, but when you send your military for six straight decades into other countries to bomb them, kill their children and women and innocent men, well, we prop up dictators, you know yeah, you take responsibility 